Look up the next time you're in Rancho Cordova. The police department is watching you. The police are installing surveillance cameras that capture live feeds in public areas. But why do city leaders feel the need to do this? CBS 13's Denise Wong is live tonight in Rancho Cordova getting answers. Denise? Well, police say they kept hearing from people in certain neighborhoods who said they didn't feel safe. And that's why you'll see cameras like these with blinking blue lights here in the Cordova Meadows neighborhood. And more cameras are coming. If people notice it, you know, it, it'll stop a lot of crime in this area. James Miller noticed these cameras and thinks they're just what's needed here at West La Loma and Folsom. And it's for the criminals. You know, I mean, if, if you're doing something on the street, you know, they catch it. That's what Rancho Cordova's police chief hopes. His department just installed a handful of these cameras in this neighborhood two weeks ago. He says they've already done their job. At the beginning of last month, we had a couple drive-by shootings in that neighborhood. In the last three weeks, we haven't had one. The cameras provide live surveillance to the police station and to sergeants in their vehicles. Having that real-time access means they can do more than just deter crime. They can help officers stop criminals in the act. This has been a community effort. Edmund and Sala lives down the street and attended the packed town hall meetings where his neighbors talked about the rise in crime. The community started to ask for cameras and the, the city was responsive. Funding is coming from the Measure H sales tax increase approved by voters last fall to improve public safety. And while some worry about their privacy. It's very 1984. What do you mean? Like Big Brother. The police chief insists there's no need. We're not looking into people's windows or in, you know, into intimate places where people have an expectation of privacy. But so if, as you can see, they're, they're out in the streets, they're on the sidewalks. And in a few weeks, the city will install more cameras in the business district a few miles up near the Walmart. Each cluster of cameras at an intersection costs about $2,500. The police chief says while this is new to this city, the Sacramento Police Department has been using cameras like these for about six months now. All right, Denise, thank you. Live for us tonight in Rancho Cordova.